Well, this is a special time of year in the European footballing cycle. It's where it all begins again, the lifting of the trophy, the winner's medals. That was all back in May. A mere reminder, a relic of the glory that was and what may be to come, perhaps, for one of these. Well, this really is a great venue. It adds so much character to every game it stages. So it's back, bigger and better than ever before. I do hope everybody is ready for another ride on the emotional roller coaster. Well, the biggest show in town just now, Peter, and everyone wants to be a part of it. Uh, a competition that seems to draw out the, the whole gamut of emotions. And in keeping with that, we've got an atmosphere with a real sense of enthusiasm here. And um, I'm hoping we get lift off once this game kicks off. we go then Jim who do you pick out as the telling individual today yeah Kylian Mbappe there's nothing more frightening for a defender when he's running Messi hits it defending of the desperate variety oh sweet feet Herrera Good defending albeit from an unexpected source you have to admire commitment like that because he could easily ignore that and just kind of walk around and let others do all the chasing but instead he looks as if he relishes the chance to uh, to dig in for his team here whistle's gone that's uh, foul it's not taken him long and that's going to be a booking Lursel gets it upfield. Uh, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Look, he's offering an apology to his teammate, who's clearly miffed at not being picked out despite making what looked like the right run. Marco Verratti. Down by a lack of accuracy. Messi tried to play it through. Yeah, I mean, he, I think he did well to, to spot the run. He just didn't get enough behind it. It happens. Forward it goes. Now the counter. And it's Messi. Well, that's a foul. Free kick's been given. And he is going into that little black book. it out to the wing there are a few waiting for it. gets up to hit it that has certainly tested the keeper well that was high class goalkeeping there to back up his his high class weight he's played it short drives it in Stitch defending, but that'll do. Oh, 
He's there to receive it. And the finish! And the follow-up. Uh, looks a foul. Yep, referee's given it. Bernat. Messi. Messi gets it out to the wing, gets away from his opponent, and through to the goalkeeper. That's just very well played. He can't hurt you with his back to goal, and he didn't go for the back heel. Di Maria. Looks to set one up. Mersault deals with it effortlessly. Questions were asked. But he's given the answers. Must be needed to be better than that, and he knows it. Hakimi. Di Maria. And the Herrera. Messi. Looks to thread it through. And that has been cleared. For a throw in. It's comes Messi! He's managed to get it away. So nil nil still, but both sides have had their moments. Marco Verratti looks to dink one in. Cleared without complication. And it's Di Maria. And it's hoisted clear. And it's played forward. Chance to break. Chip through. Gets the better of his man. And we hit half time. So now the team has broken through. But certainly not for the want of trying. It's been an interesting game up to now. But still goals. Interesting half, just missing goals, so don't be surprised if the second half brings a change to the scoreline at the break. Nil nil. Whistle goes, and we start the second half. Well, the first half hits one! Fence has got rid of that. Messi. And Messi! Oh, that was no routine save. Messi is very sporting here to acknowledge the quality of the save. A lovely little footballing moment. Hoists it forward. And he's made sure that that won't get through. Messi. Oh, well intercepted. Really alert to the danger.
Well, the moans and groans from the stands now are very audible. Tries to get it forward quickly. Sergio Ramos battles to win it back. Played into space out wide. And that has been clubbed away. And that's been won straight back. Now surely... ...has a pop! No fluke, it's what he was there for. Oh, look, there's only one player who merits all the praise for that. Not only did he finish it, but his instincts for being where he was. Absolutely top-notch. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Well, whatever the manager said in that dressing room at half-time, it's worth a treat. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Now it's Icardi. Mbappe. Now it's Icardi. He's had a goal! It's a goal! Perry Saint-Germain are back on level terms. A pretty simple finish in the end, what do you think, Jim? I just think it's clever positioning from clever movement, and when all of that is synchronised with the right pass, that's what happens. That has certainly made things interesting. Well, there's resilience for you, Peter. As a side, they never lost focus despite the setback, and this is thoroughly merited for me. Now they can... And the shot! Oh, denied brilliantly! He's very lucky to recover that, and he shouldn't have put himself in that position in the first place. Good idea, just poorly executed. Keeper's got good distance on that. Mitterland about it patiently, perhaps too patiently. Messi. Messi! Goal! Paris Saint-Germain! They've done it! It was coming! They have their reward! It is a good finish. The odds were against him. Little matter. Messi really showed good strength there. Held his man off, didn't let himself get bullied and got his effort away. Maintain control. So here comes the substitution. Paris Saint-Germain get themselves into the lead. Well, unsurprisingly, Peter, the opposition look completely stunned. I'm not sure they can gather themselves. Mbappe. There he goes, motoring forward. Hoists it forward. He's had a shot! Good stop, that wasn't easy. Oh, that's a sparkling save, absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra-sharp. Paris Saint-Germain are able now to make their substitution. It's been on the cards for uh, a few moments now. 
Sergio Ramos is there and he can get that clear. Maro Icardi looks to clip it forward. Just the goalkeeper to be. Chance! Back of the net! A two-goal cushion and it's looking safe! Mbappe versus the keeper and only one winner. Yeah, he just calmly faced the keeper and waited. It became a, a who blinks first situation. And for me, there was never any doubt as to who was going to come out on top. Paris Saint-Germain go two up and into a position of real strength. Well, it's been a, an absolutely fabulous spell for them and they're starting to look unstoppable. There could be more on the way. He's through. Chance to shoot. Corner it is. And it's been taken short. What a throw in. Yeah, that's top defending and preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities. He gets past his man. Mbappe. Gets good distance on it. Has a look and has a go. And that will sail harmlessly past. Marco Verratti put absolutely everything he had into that. Maybe better look next time. And it's played forward. And it's Di Maria. Just brushed off the ball there. And that's a foul. Simple decision for the referee. Good run, ultimately thwarted by an astute piece of defending. Crowd appreciates good football all round there. He's got away. Goes for goal. Straight at the keeper. Well, he doesn't need a second invitation, even from that range. He spotted the run and played him through. Long ball, but it's not hit its target. Mitterland could have here their final chance. They've played it short. Could cross it here. And the keeper's in command. Referee looks at his watch and blows his whistle. Paris Saint-Germain have got off to an ideal start. Three points on day one. It bodes well for the campaign ahead. Well, what are your thoughts on today's game then, Jim? Well, they've laid down a marker with 